Okay, so many of our customers come up to us and ask us the difference between 385 and 365 nanometer LED products. Um, and now when we're talking about nanometers, we're talking about the wavelength here on the electromagnetic spectrum. So it's very, very helpful for me to um, draw this for you, so just so I can show you. So the human eye sees between 400 nanometers and 700 nanometers. Around 460 nanometers is where you get your blue. 525 with LEDs normally is where you get your green, and um, a lot of LEDs, 630 is the red. Um, once we start going above 700 nanometers, that's when we start getting into the infrared spectrum. Uh, we start getting into microwaves, and radio waves, uh, the higher we go up. So we're interested in what's below 400 nanometers here. Now, the human eye can detect down to about 390 nanometers in some circumstances. Some children can actually see less than that. Um, but 385 is just on the edge of that visible spectrum. So although it is radiation, the eye can pick up some of the uh, light bleed around it. So we can see how close it is. Now, once we start moving down to 365 nanometers, that's when we start getting off the visible spectrum. So, for the majority of human beings, uh, a 365 uh, fixture will not be visible until it hits its target. Now, what does that do for you as the customer? Um, well, if I, uh, if I presented to you a 385 fixture, uh, when you uh, present to me your stage prop that's meant to be glowing in the dark from the black light effect, you'll see a purple hue around the outside of the stage prop. Uh, secondly, what we also see, you'll see a shadow at the back. So if you want a, a stage prop to completely disappear with a 385 fixture, you won't get that effect. Um, so now moving on to 365, well that's off the visible spectrum, so what we get is we get a reaction when the UV radiation hits the stage prop. Uh, that gives us the glowing effect, um, which is really what we want. And it gets rid of the shadow, it gets rid of the purplish uh, glow that you get around the sides, and it gives you the true effect of um, uh, what a black light really should be. Now, there's not many uh, people out there making 365 uh, LED products. Here we've uh, developed the Avery 4 UV. It uses a true 365 um, LED. It then uses a dichroic filter in front, which uh, just gets rid of any light bleed at all, because these LEDs, they sometimes give off just a little bit of a glow still, even though they're emitting uh, primarily radiation. We've used high efficacy LEDs, which means we get low power, high output. We've then combined all that into a fanless structure uh, for low maintenance. And then we've also um, uh, designed the fixture to be IP65, basically used in damp environments, wet environments, and completely dust tight.